Hi guys and welcome back. So just a quick one. Today I thought I would do a little bit of a life update. So last time I was on I was planning on competing in a men's physique competition at the start of July pretty much and that I was currently like prepping and everything like that for it but unfortunately everything didn't go, go as planned um, needed a little bit of time off for myself got a lot of things going on in my life at the moment which are a little bit stressy a little bit annoying so like my mental health hasn't been the greatest and with competing I feel like you need to give your absolute 110% into it and I just feel like I wasn't doing that with the prep so I pulled out and I'm not going to bother doing it anymore so that's that and I've been enjoying my food again which has been nice again training wise I haven't been training often because I've got two niggling injuries just now so my anterior deltoid on my right side is I think it's got a slight tear in it so I've been off the weights off weight training for about a week now and or just over a week actually and my right knee I've got a repetitive strain and um, just underneath my kneecap so again that's very very frustrating so I can't even train legs because it's sore even demoing an exercise because I'm a personal trainer it's hard but you just have to make do whenever you're working but training wise yeah taking a week off it I'm gonna take another week off just so that I'm fully recovered um, I'm gonna try and aid my recovery in a little bit of nutrition so loading up on my cod liver oil my magnesium my zinc smashing a hell of a lot of water and getting my green veggies in so green veggies are a big one for aiding in recovery because it's so full of micronutrients and vitamins and minerals so make sure you're eating your greens another couple of things that i thought i would update you about would be i have managed to get myself a mortgage which means I'm on the flat hunt so I've been looking at a couple flats at the moment so I've been out and about town looking at flats I've also been looking at new cars and um, since I last seen you because I need a new car to and then to end up getting a mortgage on the cheap so I'm not stretching myself every single month so I've been doing that in the background whilst trying to manage my work and my own training obviously told you about my training already which hasn't been great so work has been good work has been really busy which is good but again I'm starting to feel the effects of it like I'm still tired all the time I know I shouldn't complain that I'm tired or complain at all because I'm busy but I am super tired all the time not catching like a breath pretty much that's how it feels so all of this I'm t like compiled into one has left my mental health in not a great state. So at the moment I'm trying to get that back on track and try to keep a positive mindset throughout. The past few weeks has been pretty tough. I've been quite like negative and down and maybe even slightly a little bit depressed, which is a bit weird to admit because I've never really admitted that before. Um, so, and I don't know why, no idea. I think it's just a, an accumulation of things. Um, I think the one it gets me is stress. I just feel like I'm super, super stressed all the freaking time. And do you know what it feels like? It feels like there's a cloud over your head that's like like a dark rain cloud that's just like suppressing everything. Suppressing every emotion, like apart from like being like down all the time. Like it just, for me anyway, that's what it feels like. I feel like I've been like crushed and I'm just like put out and I'm just doing bits and bobs like getting away with everything not getting away with everything but just making use of the time that i've got and doing nothing else and not being productive not being like my usual happy self so yeah it's been a bit of a weird one the past few weeks but i mean with getting little bits and bobs like getting a new car sorted and um actually going for a flat view and just kind of like help my mental health get back into a bit, a bit more stability so again yeah that's where we're at at the moment so we're gonna keep smashing work I'm gonna try and come up with a few more YouTube videos and tutorials if I can but again this is gonna be maybe a couple a couple weeks down the line yeah I've been off it I've been off of social media quite a bit to be honest I barely been on my phone at all just for 
usual things like texting clients and that's honestly been about it. I've kept social media to minimal. I think I've only posted maybe once once in five, six days, something like that. But again, it's never ever all as it seems. You're all you're never super, super happy. I feel like social media portrays like a fake impression of what everybody's life is. And in the background, just nobody ever knows what you're actually thinking or feeling or and nobody takes it into consideration. So Again, just bear that in mind if you're ever going to give anybody hate or if you're just speaking to anybody, just bear that in mind because that could be a factor why they're being a bit weird or um, not too happy or this, that and the next thing. So, best thing to do is to confide in them, let them open up and hopefully they'll do the same to you. Alright, so a bit of a mix mash, um, little impromptu chat, I know it hasn't been very long but at least it's out there and at least I've almost admitted something that I've never admitted before so that's a bit weird but hey, it has to be done um, if, any ha if anybody has any questions or wants to chat about anything um, then let me know and we can have a little chat and discuss um, all things fitness, health uh, related and even mental health if you're struggling with anything let me know and we can talk it through and I can try and help you out as best I can. Alright, anyway, go smash your week, have a wonderful day, have a wonderful week, have a wonderful month, set your goals and I will see you in the next one.